It's difficult to conceive of a vehicle with as much fanfare as Tesla Cybertruck did last autumn. If you are a car enthusiast, a tech obsessed, or only a few minutes old Joe, you're probably hearing about the first truck of the EV giant and probably you have an outsize opinion. Why a pickup truck so much attention? It could be connected in the months leading up to the Cybertruck debut with the company's co-founder and CEO, Elon Musk, and his tweeting passion for, the coolest car he'd seen. The tech giant promised a futuristic car that would appear to be anything from the classic science fiction Blade Runner. Though that may have been a little, there's no denying that gas or battery powered the Cybertruck looks like nothing on the truck. This is because we seem to throw almost all the electric pickups from the doors, we figured we learned about car design. There are no aerodynamic, rounded corners, just sharp edges, and dramatic corners. The exterior of the vehicle has more in common than any other car on the market today with the polygonal vehicles in a primitive video game. But since this is a Tesla, the car offers powerful performance, including a total of 500 miles and the ability to twist up to 14,000 pounds. Of course, the electric truck was also revealed well before it was ready for production, becoming a trademark tradition. The time between the launch of the Cybertruck and the expected date for sale is not as bad as the still unreleased Roadster, but we must wait until the pickup goes to sales at least by the end of the next year. Meanwhile, here's what we know about one of the most awaited recent cars engine, specs, and performance of Cybertruck. While the outlandish appearance of the Cybertruck may be what gained so much publicity last year, its success may be the most radical aspect. Elon Musk never promises that the truck will reflect an electrical revolution of its kind, especially a vehicle he spent so much time designing. And if the pickup comes, maybe he's not that far away. When it is finally available for purchase, the Cybertruck will be available in three different configurations. The entry-level pickup will have a single motor and rear-wheel drive, while the two and three motor versions will have all-wheel drive. As you would expect, the more motors your Cybertruck has, the better its performance, with the tri-motor version able to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in less than 3 seconds, which is virtually unheard of for a production truck. Tesla has not released any details about the Cybertruck's horsepower as of yet, but we would anticipate that each model would deliver increasingly more grunt. What we do know is that more motors mean more range, with the top-of-the-line truck capable of traveling the aforementioned 500 miles on a single charge. The vehicle's range would have been a record for an EV at the time it was released, and although it has since been surpassed by the Lucid Air and the Tesla Model S Plaid, it is still expected to be one of the longest-range vehicles on the market when it debuts. The truck claims to have the towing capability that the most efficient gas-powered trucks are usually associated with. During the opening, Elon Musk said that the model with a single engine would be able to pull out the Ford F-150, which is nearly two times the best-selling U.S. lorry, 7,500 pounds, the dual-engine 10,000 pounds, and the tri-engine 14,000 pounds. Tesla still has to demonstrate these claims or discuss how a huge payload would otherwise impact the efficiency of vehicles, but these are attractive figures. The exterior of a science fiction film. Any conversation on the bike will probably begin with the outside, and rightly so. Today or any time in the past, the pickup looks like nothing on the lane and it's hard to imagine the change even with at least one full year to go before it was published. The Cybertruck became a joke almost immediately after it was unveiled. The angular style is nothing short of daring. Other automakers are obsessed with sleek curves and flowing aerodynamic lines, but the pickup is all sharp angles and flat planes. That applies not only to its overall body shape, but also to details like its eye-catching strip like LED headlights, geometric windows, and chunky wheel fenders. In reality, the designers seem to have been so obsessed with its geometric shape that they chose to forego side-view mirrors entirely. However, the vehicle's outlandish nature raises some concerns. One reason cars and trucks share design features is that they help the car survive the rigors of everyday use and possible accidents. The Cybertruck, on the other hand, is not in this category. For example, 
The vehicle lacks a crumple zone, which is supposed to withstand the force of a collision. Two of the most eye-catching style features, the headlight strip and the lack of side view mirrors, aren't even street legal at the moment. Oh, and unless the prototype version is shrunk, the truck cannot fit inside a standard size garage. Naturally, the visual style, geometric shape, and hulking scale of the vehicle are not all that unorthodox in its construction. The body would also be wrapped in an impenetrable, structural skin of stainless steel Ultra Hard 30X Cold Roll, which may explain the lack of a crumple zone. Hopefully, it's harder than Tesla's glass of armor. During the vehicle's unveiling, the supposedly unbreakable material did not break out once or twice. Is the Cybertruck beauty? No, not so. Does his design not even work or not? Are there any questions? Yes, yes. Yet the development of a pickup from which few can look is deserved by Tesla and Musk. It does not only look distinctly different in appearance from other trucks on the market, it breaks fully out of the other brand's design language. You must admit that the road would be an exciting place in motion with love or hate it. The Cybertruck Interior The interior of the Cybertruck is almost as singular as its organism. There are a lot of sharp angles, particularly in the dashboard area, which looks like a flat ledge with a steering wheel that is a huge 17-inch touchscreen that stands out. All of them, like the chairs, are a little sparkling. Some padding is obvious, but they're not shouting warmth exactly. But the inside looks spacious. The brand states that the Cybertruck can comfortably seat six adults regardless of the version and has a total outer storage area of 100 cubic feet. It makes sense to everyone who has seen the Cybertruck in close proximity. The truck bed is 6.4 feet or the freight bay is truly huge, as some call it. Including a vault, trunk, and navigation pillars. Accessories and add-ons Musk vowed to be so much more than usual pickup on the Cybertruck. The CEO stated that the car with some sick attachments would be available at the end of the year. And the May add-ons industry indicates he may be right. Stainless steel and a camper-like trailer enable you to transform the bed into a mobile living space. The four-wheel, electric Cyberquad ATV that fits directly into a truck bed is also at work. And these are just the official accessories of the first squad. Some firms are seeking to take steps now. Ten months since the debut of the vehicle, a number of projects inspired by Cybertruck have appeared around the world. The most remarkable of these is a massive building called the Cyberhouse, which was very obviously inspired by the car, and provides a garage that can housing the pickup actually. Price for the Cybertruck. Will it be meaningful? What may be shocking, and what could be the most attractive aspect of the Cybertruck, is its price. The vehicle is surprisingly accessible according to Tesla. The single engine model starts at a reasonable $39,900, with the two-engine and tri-engine edition selling for $49,900 and $69,900 respectively, despite its cutting-edge characteristics and superior performance. Tesla Auto Driving Technology autopilot, can also be added to the car for $8,000, although the brand warns of rising costs over time. It should also be noted that Tesla's autopilot still does not provide genuinely autonomous driving, but rather acts as an improved vehicle driver assistance feature. The Cybertruck is a lot to intrigue about, but the wild pre-order numbers can be the largest source of its price. 200,000 people have reserved the trucks within a week of their announcement and this figure has increased more than three times since then. Of course, pre-ordering a Cybertruck costs just $100, and if you do not want to purchase it, this is entirely refundable. Nevertheless, the pre-order provides evidence that the vehicle is exciting and anticipated before release. For more informative, tech news, subscribe to us, we are going to make more informative and helpful videos, so stay tuned, thanks for watching.